what is the 80-20 rule? Well, some people can live by this. Some people do 90-10. So that what means that 80% of your diet is really clean, really good, on track, and then 20% is whatever happens to come along that day, or maybe you decide to go to a party or something like that. I personally think 90-10 is better, and that's where you can have one day of maybe going off track but you think about it, if you were to eat three meals a day, right, and you had seven days of the week you're eating three meals a day, that's 21 meals. So 10% of that is two meals, that, two meals that can be off track, two meals that maybe aren't perfect. That is really doable for most people because most people during the week, if they're working or something, they're on track. It's the weekends that um, usually set people off. So try it. And in your brain, it kind of makes you relax because you know you make a conscious decision. All right, this is my 10% meal and I'm going to enjoy it. Or maybe like a couple weeks ago, we went out to dinner with my daughter and son-in-law and my daughter wanted to have a beer after dinner, another beer, she already had one. And my, my son-in-law and I said, you have beer, we'll have ice cream. Uh, so we went and got a double-decker ice cream cone and a sugar cone. I can't tell you how long it's been since I had one of those, but it was delicious. And I just thought, you know, I'm just going to enjoy this moment. This is great. I rarely have ice cream. So you know what? You can do life like that, okay? Unless you're seriously ill, unless you're critically ill, like fighting cancer or something, then you got to be all in, right? If you have over 100 pounds to lose, I would say be all in for three months and then start to give yourself those little breaks in between. It really makes the brain just relax and you can enjoy your family and friends. All right, you guys, I'm sitting outside. Actually not a brutally hot day here in West Texas. It's not even 90 degrees, which I'll celebrate. Bye for now.